YouTube has a go in the goat house is back. <laughs> and Golden Taint, the third, <laughs> is the free agent we're talking about today. Eagles wide receivers. Did they just trade for a rental and they let him go now? Crazy. He gone. You think? Yeah. You think? I think they liked him a lot, though. But we'll find out if he's going back. Yeah. Well, um, I'm going to go in there, jump right from the start, and I'm going to take out the Eagles. No, why did you get started? Because I wanted to. Is that actually what you're doing first? Yeah, I'm going to take him off. He's not going back. How dare you what? just. What? Confirmed. You just leave it up there for a little while. Confirmed, Pete. Right. You're out of your mind. I didn't even want to start yet because I wanted to make sure everyone knew we had a new Twitter because the other one's gone for now. Uh, we'll at start. Goat House NFL, link in the description. Check out the Instagram as well. We're trying to build that Twitter up to where it was before. Have a situation there. So please give us a follow. We much appreciate it. But back to the video. A uh, lot of landing spots up here. They all could use receivers. They all could use a big-time player like Gold Taint. And... Uh, yeah, there's a lot of teams. There's a lot of teams. But Junior already took the Eagles off. I wouldn't have taken them off that early. But once we get to the end, we can always bring teams back that one of us took off like an idiot too early. Hey! Uh, so stick around to the end, and then you'll get our final predictions. That was a uh, false start by Junior, by the way. That's a it five was. pick penalty. Sorry. Yeah. Who's next? Who's going? Danny. Lions. Get yeah. him out of here. It's not going back? They're pretty cool, though. Like, it third, would be really cool. Throw a router, Free, they, if, like if, half he does, there was, if he does, there was definitely collusion involved. Yeah. A lot of collusion. They loaned him out. Yeah. I mean, it's kind of like a role as Chapman when the Cubs got him and went right back to the Yankees. So, I mean, like, come on now. Yeah, but the Cubs won the World Series, so it's That's okay. True. Yeah. They'll take that every, t- every time. Um, who am I going to take off here? Um, I, I'm going to go... Do it. Do what? Just do it. I'll take the Panthers off. They have, uh, you know, they only have, they don't have the worst cap situation, but, you know, they got, it's not the best either. And they have, uh, you know, Cam Newton's hurt. What are they going to do with that? They got to get a quarterback. They got other situations they got to take care of here. So I think it makes sense that it's more likely it goes to one of these other teams. P. Am I up? P. I'm not you want to be. I'm going to take the Jets off. Um, I think. Golden Tate said that he wanted to play for a contender. He wants to play for a ring here, so I don't think the Jets are going there anytime soon. You sure about that? Well, if Pete's yeah. sources are correct here, I'm going to have to go ahead and take off the Bills. The Bills can play. Yeah, the Bills can. Yeah, they're, they're a few years away. I mean, they made the playoffs two, last year. Not this year, but yeah, last Nathan year. Yeah, Nathan Peterman led them to a surge. No. <laughs> it's Tyron Taylor. A losing, a losing surge. Remember they like benched him in the process and still somehow made the playoffs. Yeah. That was incredible. Stupidity. Was incredible. Uh, remove the Raiders for me, please. Thank you. The Raiders? Yeah, they got a lot of picks. Got a lot of damage they can do through the draft. They're going to build a young team up. They're going to have them closely bond and grow as a team, and then they're not going to sign a Are they going to be athletic, two. those young players? Uh, the thing I know about Oakland for a long time is that they like the athletic yeah, players. that's true. Younger and more athletic ones. That's a Bulls move, but this is a... Raiders move, so. Okay. So athletic and younger. Who wants to go? Yes. I think it's. Uh, I think it's your turn. You only took off the Eagles, right? No, I just took off the Bills. True. You're up. <laughs> I'm up. Yeah. All right. Um, I I'm gonna go with the Browns. I think it's mm. possible, but you no. Know, continue to build the draft receiver isn't the biggest need, but they could use another one, but. I just think the other teams are more likely. Pete. Uh, we'll go with. Let me get. We'll go with the Steelers. Steelers? Yeah. Um, you know, they they already have a couple of young guys that are going to get some more playing time than already proven themselves. So I think they'll continue to build to like draft or draft their receivers. They don't really sign anyone in free agency, I don't think. But uh, yeah. And I think I don't again going back to like well actually the Steelers are a pretty solid team but I think they're on the decline. Yes, that is true. Mm. I'm gonna take off the Bucks. Bucks are gone. I think the Bucks need to. Uh, they have a lot to figure out with their secondary, so I think that's where you're gonna see a lot of their free agency money go to is their secondary and their defense. Um, their offense was explosive at times last year. But, need uh, a running back. Yeah, they need a running back. Well, I think they still need another wide receiver, but you might as well get a you know late-round pick for a well, receiver. Or they may be losing Deshaun. 
Well, they probably are going to lose the show. Probably are losing the show. And Humphreys is a free agent. But yeah. Yeah. Is it my turn? Yeah. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and take the Redskins off the board. Ooh. Redskins off the board for the simple reason that they're not going to be contending anytime soon. They're decent. They're pretty decent. That's, that, that's all, Pete. What if Alex Smith was there? Could they be contending? I think, yeah. Alex contending Smith for healthy playoffs or contending for a Super Bowl? They were winning the to division win until he got hurt. They, they were, were winning the division until yeah, he got hurt. Yeah, they were like 8-7 and seven until he got hurt. Actually, I don't know when he got hurt. But still, no, he, they, were like, they were like right near 500. They were like 5-2 and two or 6-2. and two. <laughs> Maybe not. <laughs> they were winning. I'll have to check my sources to get back to you on that one. Division, Danny. Your sources are out of whack. It's just a little off. You just know, a little <laughs> off. But, I mean, we knew exactly where they were going to end up. Alex Smith is an 8-8 kind of guy, okay? No, he took the Chiefs to the playoffs. Yeah, eight and eight can get you to the playoffs, bro. No, it doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> Titans went nine and seven, didn't make it. Uh, we'll go with the Dolphins. The Dolphins. Not feeling it. You're just not feeling it. I mean, they don't have a. They don't have a. They, don't, they gotta figure out their quarterback situation. I don't think Golden Tate's gonna be really happy. With, real happy with that. Can you see him in a Dolphins jersey though? I can't see it. Okay. Is it me? Who's is it? Maybe, receiver maybe it's receiver maybe always you. wants to know who their quarterback's going to be. Like if the Dolphins are who their QB one is. Uncertain yeah. there. I'll take the Colts off. I think they're looking for either uh, draft prospects oh. or, or a big boy, or a big boy, <laughs> basically. So big I, body thumper, a big or body. a draft prospect who is a big boy. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe they bring in two big boys. Ooh. I don't know. Ah, oh, this is going to be tough. You're thinking out loud. I think it's my turn. Yeah, I know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead. We need a little bit more organization. Who's going next? It's we have an scattered. order. I don't know your jump deal. In. It doesn't. Have, it doesn't. It's, there's no strict rules here. <laughs> okay. Go ahead, Junior. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and take the boys off. Taking the boys. Uh, we're just splitting hairs here at this point. So uh, I just, you know, I like the other fits better. All right. Solid answer. <laughs> sound exact. You sound exactly like I'd you know what you're talking about. I don't need a receiver as bad as the other teams, so these teams may be willing to pay more. Mm, good point. Ooh. Ooh. I still don't know who I want to take off. You're up. I know. I don't know who I want to take off. Are you going to skip your turn again? No, we're going to take off the Ravens. Taking mm. off the Ravens. I think they're going to want a younger receiver. They can contend, and I think people are uh, excited to play with their quarterback there, but I, I – I, I feel like they're just going to go through the draft because they want somebody young and that they could groom into their own. Right, and the young players are going to bond and stuff? No. Only in Oakland? Only in Oakland. Okay. Because literally they're going to have, like, how many people in the same draft class? Come on now. Okay. I'm just like confirm. Fresh, I'm just like freshman year of high school. You're trying to find your friends and then they're your brothers for your life. Come on now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Wait. W- okay. Move on. Please. Danny's out of his mind over here. <laughs> Who wants that to makes go? Perfect sense. Pete, yeah. me? Yeah. Um, I'm gonna go ahead. Let me go ahead and take the Packers off. It's tough. Mm. I think you can replace. Like you can be like a Randall Cobb replacement upgrade, uh, but I think their money will be spent. Maybe offensive line, they always want to keep that fresh, you know, and pass rush, pretty much everything on defense besides corner. Uh, so I think the money can be spent that way, but in possibly Antonio Brown, if they were going to get a receiver, then they would trade for Antonio Brown. Uh, but it's possible, definitely possible. I just, you know, we got to split hairs because there's a lot of good teams up here. Uh, <laughs> yeah, what? that's, uh, yeah. P. I'm up. You're uh, up. This is tough now. I don't know. Um, we still should we, should we take someone off or should we just like leave it like this? Or someone want to? We gotta take at least one more off. One more I thought off. the Eagles could have been on here still. I, think so too. I thought the I like the Ravens, but I don't know. I don't know if that would be actually my pick though. That's the thing. Uh, I got a good fit. My pick's up here. This is a tough one to predict. Yeah, a lot of pressure on us here. Tough. No pressure at all. I do uh, like – I'm not picking either one, but I do like the Eagles and the Ravens as possibilities, strong possibilities. I do like the Ravens, though, because I think their defense is, like, built to win right now. 
and they don't, I don't know if they really want to get a bunch of young players on offense because they don't want to rebuild the offense at the same time their defense is championship team right now or championship defense. So they want to see it. They want to like speed the offensive build process up here. So Golden Tate definitely would be a good uh, good guy to have in there, but you never know. So Pete, who are we taking off? Yeah, I'm taking someone off still. Uh, we'll take the Patriots off. Um, I mean, he's a similar player to Julian Edelman. You know, like they have Patriots like their they're like smaller, shiftier guys that just can have like an option route out there and just read the defensive back and, and choose where they want to go. Like Golden Tate would be good at that, but I think they're good with Edelman and they might draft draft someone as well. But that's just tough to we're we're. What, what are you guys saying over there? Splitting hairs. We're splitting hairs, Pete. We're splitting hairs right now. Yeah, we are. Don't take them off, but I'm going to make a case for why the Saints are not going to get them. Okay. Because I'm assuming some somebody here is going to want to take the Saints. Although I think it's a good fit. Yeah, one in three chance there. I think it's a good fit for him to go to the Saints because they're in win-now mode. But as an older receiver, he's probably going to want a long-term contract, and the two other teams on here can offer them that long-term contract where he can – Grow old with the team together here. So I'm just going to give you my pick right now, and it's going to be the Niners. Picking the Niners. Not to take them off. Yeah. For I'm... the team he's going to. Okay. That's your team. Put them over here. All right. Anybody else make a pick? Want to make a pick? Pete. I'll let you, I'll let you go. <laughs> um, I don't know. I, I like the Niners too. It's, I don't know. I, I can see him on the Saints. I can see him signing. Golden Tate strikes strike me as a, a one or two year deal kind of guy. I don't see him signing something crazy towards the end of his. I mean, he's not towards the end of his career, but I mean, he's yeah. gonna want a long something long term, especially if he gets injured in that one year. He's gonna want something long term. Still gets paid. Still gets paid, but he's gonna want him to be locked up for at least four or five years. That's my that's my this case. This might be the toughest one we've done. Yeah, this is between tough. we we started these videos last year, and we did a lot already this year. This is probably the toughest one because I like I like all these teams. And I like there's a few teams that we have off the board that I really like too. I think I'm gonna ultimately have to go with the Saints. It's just it's just what my uh, what my heart and my head are saying, okay. and I'm listening. See, I think he can go there, and I think they can win the Super Bowl, and he'd be happy winning the Super Bowl. But I just feel like if he gets injured, that's gonna put a huge pothole in his freaking uh, career. I think, you know, or as far as the money that he'd be getting for it, that's why I think he there's wants no to get potholes locked up. down south. It's true. Okay. What's Pete's pick? Oh, I don't even know how to pick. I, I mean, I like the Titans. That's my team right there. I like like for him to have him. He's from Tennessee. It's his hometown. Uh, Could have told pick. us this before he started making up. picks, Pete. Yeah. She gave us the insider he's, scoops. Uh, he's, that's it's his, his hometown? He's from Tennessee. <laughs> okay. Uh, the hometown kid. That's why I kind of want to pick him. But, like, I know there's another free agent that the Titans, I think, are going to be really interested in at receiver. Ooh. Don't Roger better not say it. Yeah, I'm not gonna say it. So I don't know if they're gonna go after him or. I mean, they might go after both, but not 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 sign both, but definitely like have interest in both of them. But I kind of like what Riz was saying about the Ravens. I actually want I actually want want you to pull them back. I want to pick the Ravens here. All right, let me let me add something then, because if it was out of these three teams, if I had to choose from these three teams, I would pick the Titans. I'm picking the Titans too out of these three. But there's two teams that I liked more than these three teams, and one was the Ravens. We pull them back up, put them over here. And the other one was the Patriots. Um, kind of my original thought were those two teams, and that's usually like usually what I want to stick with is my original thought. Uh, like like you said, he wants to go to a contender. The Patriots definitely need receiver. They need him badly. Was the only one under contract is Edelman and Josh Gordon, but I don't really count that. Um, so they definitely need they definitely need more of these guys. I don't think they care what type of receivers they are either. Like the Patriots, I think they'll just take, you know, whoever gets open, whoever's good. Um, so my choice was originally between the my, my choice originally was going to be originally it was going to be the Patriots, but once I started talking about the Ravens more and more, I started to like it. Um, you got to so pick he's, one. So he's going everywhere. everywhere. Pete, you're picking the Ravens. Yeah, just because. So get rid of the Titans. Like they, get rid of the Titans. They built. I want to get rid of the Titans. That's well, my second. But nobody's we're, picking them. That's we're leaving second. all their first that's picks up there. Choice. You don't get a second. All right. Because the Patriots are my second. That's 1A, 1B. This is so hard to choose, like, one team. But, but like, yeah, I think 
the Ravens. Um, My pick's the Patriots. Just just because like Lamar is so young and they need he needs someone like just reliable and Golden Tate's like that reliable guy and I think they have the money to spend. Their defense is pretty young. Like they built through the draft, they got that defense up. Like Riz was saying, so I think he's a he's a perfect fit for their team. So are we all picking each picking a different team. Yeah, this is the first right. time in the Goat House history and Frogs Angels history. Everybody picked a different team. I do like the Titans and I do like the Eagles as well. Yeah. Yeah, that's all you got? Yeah, pretty much. Let's sign off. That's our Twitter. Link in the description. That's our Instagram. Link in the description. Check it out. 20K is our subscriber goal. If you check haven't it subscribed, out. yeah, check it out. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, please do so. We got a lot of NFL content, free agency, draft, rumors, mock drafts, predictions in season. Click that bell, turn the notifications on, and click the like button. I mean, much appreciated. But that's going to do it for this one. Thanks, everyone, for watching. Goodbye.